Hello guys, this is the tutorial how to make out of focus camera. The first, you need to bring the background or anything you want to blur as a props. You drag the background and you save that as a prop, like this. And then, of that, uh, before we do this, I will bring the characters into the skin. I choose the. This is a free, it's not about this, but we were talking about uh, blurring background or out of focusing camera. Oh, wait a minute. I bring the character into the cartoon animator. Okay, this takes uh, a minute. Wait a moment. Okay, after we bring the characters, and then we will. Right now, how to make camera effect. Okay, we will make this picture fit. Okay, wait a minute. Yes, here is good. I bring a little bit of front. Fit the screen, camera screen. Okay, this is good. After you make this fit, and don't forget, you click the props. that, And then you go, and then you go to the composer editor. If you... Uh, duplicate this if you duplicate this here yeah, you will work in twice yeah, so it is not recommended I go back and then let's go to the composer editor okay we click the background and then we go to the computer editor but before that I will give some motion to the character wait a minute I choose one maybe this Okay, like this, and then I add some motion add again, like this, okay, uh, okay, that's enough for the, for the motion for this time. Okay, let's go to the Composer Editor. After we go to the Composer Editor, and then we send it to the PSD editing. There we go. You see here, there are a pictures, RL, image, and then you choose the image, and then my suggestion you create some picture. Copy this, select, or, and then you edit, copy, and then paste this, and then we will get some of a picture. Again, one, two, three. Copy and then once more time four. Okay, so you ch choose one and then you make this picture blurry. Okay, filter and then choose Gaussian blur. Here we go. You see here, this is at the 25 point, and if you drag this into the zero, the picture will be normal. Okay, so for this, the first picture I will set at 25. Okay. And then I save this and I so I I forget so I rename this to the 25 and then I select that and then I just one more and then I blur this again Gaussian blur filter Gaussian blur and then I set this into the 20 okay and then rename it 20 and then the next picture I will set this into 15 okay select filter and then blur, Gaussian blur, then I rename this, set this into 15, and then I rename this 15. And then the next is 10. Okay, I select this, give name 10, and then the Gaussian blur is will be set as 10. But this is too far, because of the picture is still blur, I will create one more, and then set uh, into 5. Okay? One more picture. Okay, I rename. I drag this into uh, up. Okay, and then I rename, rename this five. So I make this blur at five. Set at five. Blur. Okay, I think that's finished. And then I rename this uh, the last one into zero. Mean that mean the picture normal picture. Okay, good. And then file and then save. And then we go back into the 
cartoon animator the first. Okay, here we go. We are in the screen. So what do we do? We choose here. And then you choose option here. Deselect the character. And then you select the prop only. So it's easy to you see. You see here. And then you click on the motion. And then don't forget you also resize this. Minimize so easily to see the frame. Okay, we will make this. At this number is the blur position. But we can setting that uh, easily at the next time. For the first time, like this. We choose at that point if the picture of background will be automatically blur. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay, and then you choose 25 here. And you see that the background is blur. And then you in another place. Okay. This is the automatic. This is fully blur. And then you choose here. This is the 20 blur, and then you choose the 20, and then in here you choose 15, and then here you choose 10, and then here you choose 5, and then the first frame you choose 0, and the first frame it is 0. Like this, okay. After finish, and then you can pause this, and then drag to up, don't forget to check this, push. Collect click and then you click here, drag all frame and then you right click, right click and then you just add action menu and then you rename this auto wait auto focus on. And that meaning the auto focus will be on. Okay, finish. We have creating the auto focus on and then we will make a uh, auto focus off. Okay, it's still processing, and then the USB this auto focus on, and then we will remove uh, motion animation, and then we creating the auto focus off. Okay, this is an opposite way, and the end you choose zero. Okay, you just write again, and then you choose zero. Okay, this is my opinion. So the blur will change slowly. Okay, and then you choose five, and then here you choose 10, uh, this is here so 15, meaning from the blur into the not blur, you see, from 0, uh, from 25 until 0, but we setting from the end, okay, here and the 5, wait a moment, still loading, the processing, okay, after finish, and then we will collect this, collect clip, right click, add, into action menu and then in this auto focus off that's meaning if the you will back to the normal okay have done this let's see uh wait a minute so the background the background is the prop have a uh, two option the first is auto focus on and auto focus off okay we already let that we'll back to the first and then let's uh take an action because of we want to the first is on normal background and we choose zero for the first time okay let's start thing so here the animation we will take um the camera effect here and then we will make character is zoom in this close enough position here yeah and then in this position will be blur so we'll make that okay we will make that first you click that background, you click the camera first, and then uh, the camera will close with this position. Yes. So, the first time you take this autofocus on. Yes, autofocus on, click here. And then the background will be autofocus. Okay, then stopping here, and then we will. Uh, drag the camera focus here but don't forget you need to push the camera first if you like this the camera is not working because still off okay we will get the character position here close enough okay you see and then we will auto focus here 
But before that, and then after, uh, after that, we will make autofocus off. You just click and then autofocus off. Like this. Uh, but we will make the camera move forward and go back again. Okay, so we take the character into the first position and then we bring this into the first frame. Okay, and this. Oh, wait a minute. The camera is on. Okay, we resize the position. Okay, wait a minute. Uh, okay, have this fully blur. Okay, that's mean the camera is close, you know, our focusing on the character. So, we can choose this and then auto focus uh, the object. The camera automatically focus at the character, but it's not too close enough. We will bring this character close enough. And then after you push the camera, tracking the camera will at this position. You see, let's play. Okay, close, 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 and then the camera focus on the character. Okay, I think like that, that is the process or uh, for the next. Okay, keep watching and then I hope this can be useful for you. See you for the next video. Bye-bye. I go to auto focus now. And back to normal camera now, it's camera trick, hee hee hee. Thanks for watching, bye.